Rob the Plumber here. I'm going to teach you how to scrap a hard drive. There's actually quite a bit of good stuff inside of each one of these. Okay, here's all the parts that you actually get out of a hard drive. I'll go through piece by piece. First of all, this is the hard drive lid. 99% of these are made out of stainless steel. You can get a whole bunch of these, keep them together and sell them as stainless steel scrap. Um, definitely not the uh, highest value item out of the hard drive. Next, definitely something cool. This is my favorite part of the hard drive is the neodymium magnets. They are super fun to play around with. Here's the magnet right here. And the special thing is, is this alloy metal right here. It does not allow the, the magnetism to flow through. You see I take these this way and they do not stick. So that is a special tip of metal. Flip them around and it's a total different story. And these magnets are super hard to get apart here. Definitely fun to play with. Put groups of uh, 20 to 30 together, sell them as a package on eBay, make yourself 40, 50 bucks. Next, here is the actual hard drive, the hard drive disc. Um, this shiny, shiny material here is actually palladium, a very rare and expensive metal. I'm not sure if there's a way to actually get the uh, palladium off the discs. I do save all the discs. I haven't sold any, but uh, the actual disc itself is made out of aluminum. Next, you get these. These are retainer rings for the top of the hard drive motor. Of course, you get yourself a hard drive motor. Body's made out of aluminum. Here you get all these little gold contacts. I keep all this uh, leaf. Keep the ribbons. Which brings me to the next thing. Here's your, um, your reader. Now inside of here you get a very high quality ball bearing. You can pop these out. Uh, I prefer just for this video to keep it all in one piece. On most hard drives this right here is pure copper. I'm not sure on this one, this is an older drive, I'm not sure what type of this metal this is. If you happen to know, leave it in the comments below. The actual little reader arms are um, machined aluminum. And I'm sure this, the little uh, read write uh, tips or some type of uh, rare earth metal. This is the best piece of the hard drive right here. The, this is the circuit board from the back of the hard drive. The metals that they use on hard drive uh, circuit boards are platinum, uh, silver, gold. Uh, since there's magnetism and uh, such, they all these connections have to be high grade quality. You don't want to be losing memory, losing your data. Definitely keep your circuit boards off the back of your hard drives. Here is the body from the hard drive. Six ounces of high grade aluminum. Now I keep all my aluminum, especially the aluminum that you get out of a, mainly for the reason that I melt the metal and use it to make parts with. Uh, aluminum is nice to work with. It's extremely high grade. Rob the plumber here. Taking apart a an old hard drive. the warranty sticker is there's always a screw behind there
typical board. You got to be careful to keep all these little connections here. They hide the screws underneath the uh, cases. Satisfying when you get something like this for nothing. This here, right here, is palladium. These here, this and underneath, rare earth magnet. Now I'm going to tell you one thing. I'm going to take this off right here. These magnets are seriously really tough. Once you pull those two screws out, that hold that. There's the magnet right there in one of them. How hard drives work is this? Moves back and forth so that this spins and it reads and writes the data. Now, new ones will have two, three, four, five of these discs. This has got little feelers right there. They go on both sides of the disc and they do the reading and writing. Now this inside of here is actually a really good high quality ball bearings. Small parts like this I usually keep a little toolbox full. But these are very high quality meant to be turned millions and millions and millions of times. So, right there. And then that just pops out just like that. You get your finger pinched in there, and trust me, you'll feel it. And you want to take out these screws right here. So you pull this off, you get this a pure aluminum ring. <coughs> and another aluminum ring. And there is the aluminum disc coated with palladium. You take out these three screws right here to get the hard drive motor out. And there is the motor. Of course you're left with this perfect piece of machined aluminum.